As a big superhero comic book fan, I was very excited that they gave us like the original Cheetah, uh, Priscilla Rich, in the uh, CMF series for the DC superheroes. I know, Priscilla Rich, yeah, very creative. But hey, it was the golden age of comics. We were new. It was kind of more for kids than adults. But here is the very first Cheetah. And, uh, you know, she also came with a Wonder Woman costume that was a San Diego, uh, Wonder Woman set that was a San Diego Comic-Con exclusive. But, you know, we finally had the original Cheetah. And the thing is, Cheetah's actually had several people don on the identity, take on the identity and the costume. They've kind of made it their own. And the second woman to take on the costume was Deborah Domain. But Deborah Domain came around the, the uh, Bronze Age of comics. And really the only difference between her and Priscilla here was the headpiece. They kind of had the same costume. You know, the, the amount of skin showing and how risque it was was you know, up to the different artists, but they were very much basic the same character costume. The only difference was that uh, Priscilla had this smooth cat kind of cap or, you know, like costume pull over her, while um, Deborah had um, her long hair, her long red hair showing and ears sticking out. But I also had the Tiger Lady from the CMF Series 14 Monster Series. And this hairpiece was perfect. It's kind of this reddish brown. You've got these yellow ears sticking out. So all I had to do was take off Priscilla's headpiece, put on my Tiger Lady's headpiece, and now I've got the second person to become Cheetah during the Bronze Age. And this is just a fun little um, way to customize this minifigure to give us two of the original Cheetahs from DC Comics. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe or check out some of our other videos. Until next time, let's keep building together.